both. Uh, reason and emotion are intimately related psychological uh, functions and they are both absolutely important to a full human life. Uh, some philosophical traditions I think are corrupt and what they have done is separated reason and emotion. But the way uh, 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 the human psychology actually works is that reason comes first. We have an emotional capacity. We have a capacity for processing information abstractly. But we make decisions about what's important and what is in true. And on the basis of that, we program our own emotional capacity. So for example, if I uh, come to believe, just to take, a, take an example, that say the, the death penalty or capital punishment is good and moral, uh, that there are very bad human beings out there who have done terrible things and the justice system properly should execute those people. So if I come to believe that, then what's going to happen when a very bad criminal is caught and found guilty and executed is good. I will feel a positive emotion. That was the right thing to do. Uh, but on the other hand, suppose I believe by contrast that every human life is sacred uh, and that no human being should ever be killed, that the justice system is flawed and cannot be trusted, and that's not our place to, uh, to make these sorts of decisions in order to keep our own sense of morality pure. Suppose I believe all of those things, uh, then what will happen is when I hear that the justice system has caught someone, even if I think that's a bad person and has executed that person, then I will feel anger and revulsion. Now the point then is going to be that in both cases, the strong emotions that you feel result from the previous intellectual beliefs that you have come to acquire. And so, but both are also important. It is important to think and to come to important beliefs about matters of justice and other things. And the natural thing for human beings is to have strong emotions on the basis of that. And I think uh, uh, it's important, uh, partly it's that you know, having strong emotions is uh, uh, a way of enjoying life. It's also a, a way of having your mind programmed in a way so if there are dangers out there or negative things out there, that you are picking up on your emotions will be a clue that there's something dangerous or worrisome to worry about. So emotions are playing an important uh, functional role in your life and so they should be attended to. But the point is your reason and your emotions work together.